Hey guys, how are we doing? As you can see, I'm out in the field and I've got the 3DR Solo with me. So today, it's going to give you the first flight, we'll be able to get it up in the air. But I'm not going to do that in this video. What I'm going to do in this video is just basically show you the actual calibration of the sticks and the calibration of the actual 3DR Solo. Don't want to make this video too long. Um, the next video, I'll actually make the first flight. But this video, we're going to go ahead and calibrate it. So firstly, as you can see, I've already got the drone out and the propellers are on. So to start with, we're going to power on the drone by click it, pressing that button there. And as you can see, the drone's powering on. Same time, we'll power on now the transmitter. I'm not sure if you can actually see that there, guys. And we'll wait for it to all power on. We're just going to go with the step-by-step -step instructions on the app and exactly how to calibrate this. It's the first time I've done it, so hopefully it'll be fine. Currently says waiting for solo on the actual transmitter. I haven't turned on the app or connected to Wi-Fi yet because literally I've just turned it on. But we'll just give it a second while it's searching for GPS. And while it's doing that, I'll go onto the phone and we will connect to the actual Wi-Fi Solo link, it's already gone and connected itself. Go over to Solo app, go into Solo app. I will definitely need to get a sunshade for this. Okay, we're connected to Solo. We're going to go to settings. So you heard the quad making a bit of noise there. Solo settings level calibration and compass calibration we'll start with the level calibration and it says calibrate level ensure solo can fly accurately remove propellers and press start calibrating oh so it actually wants me to remove the propellers so i'll just quickly go ahead and put that there and go and remove the propellers Removal. So there's the props. Remove them and press start calibrating. So now we're going to start. Place solo perfectly still on the level surface, which it is already. Press next. Place solo perfectly still on its left side. So obviously that's the front of the solo. That will be the left side of Solo. Solo's on its left, press next. Place Solo perfectly still on its right side. So which we will do now. Press next. Place Solo still with its nose pointing up. Okay, so uh, noise pointing up that way. Hit next. Place Solo perfectly still with its nose pointing down. It's basically all four ways, obviously. Press next. Place Solo perfectly still upside down. Don't like the ideas of that on mud, but I'll go ahead and do it. And click next. Calibration complete. And it says go fly. So we'll just hit the go fly button. Do that. So that is the level calibration done. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and do the compass calibration. So again into settings, solo settings on the app, down to compass calibration. Calibrating the compass ensures solo can fly accurately. Calibrate solo away from buildings, con concrete and metal surfaces actually thinking I'm going to put the props on for so it doesn't say it so we'll just go ahead and calibrate it like this I actually think I should put the props on so what I'll do is I'll actually put the props on before I calibrate it so again black on black silver on silver silver one And 
there's a black one. You never know, this could be wrong. It hasn't actually asked me to put the props back on, but that's what I'm going to do. There you go. And then we are going to now start calibration. Rotate solo in every direction until calibration is complete. Okay, it's a completely different one. We'll go around the normal ways. We'll go around this way. It's a bit of a funky looking calibrating. Calibrating. I think we haven't done this way yet. See, I'm just still spinning it, just waiting for it to say. There you go, it had a little beep. There you go, calibration complete. Is what it says on the actual transmitter. Go fly. So there you go, guys. That is my video on how to level, calibrate, and compass calibrate the 3DR Solo. Thanks for watching, and catch you in my next video, guys. The next video is actually going to be straight after this, where I'm going to actually take it off for its first flight. So be made sure to be subscribed and I'll see you soon. Thanks guys. Bye.